Welcome, brain investigators. Today, we're going to learn some things about our brains and a computer program called Fast Forward. What's brain got to do with it? How you learn and why some things stick and some things don't. At first, school seems easy for a lot of kids, but gradually as the work gets harder and there is more to do, things aren't always so easy. For some students, it really starts changing about third or fourth grade when you were expected to learn more independently. Or maybe you are trying to learn English and do the work at the same time, which takes twice as much effort. We all want to fit in and be accepted for who we are. It's hard sometimes if we learn differently from other kids or haven't had the same experiences they have had in school. Sometimes learning to read is really difficult, especially with English. Reading is not something that the brain does naturally. It's a system we've created that's based on our language system in the brain. Thanks to technology, we can look at what happens in the brain when someone is reading. These images are from an fMRI. They show pictures of brain activity. On the left, the student's brain when reading is pretty easy shows areas of activity in the reading brain. We see tight areas of activation and those three areas working together which means they are connected during reading. On the right, this is an image of a struggling reader's brain. You can see those key areas are not tightly activated in the same way or the same places. There is nothing wrong with this brain. It isn't damaged or anything like that. It simply hasn't been activated yet to be a strong reading brain. The good news is this brain can be exercised to become stronger and a better reader and learner. Fast forward has been proven to help here is another fMRI image of the brain. You can see on the left a proficient reader with the areas of activity while reading. In the middle is a struggling reader's brain before using fast forward. On the right you see the brain of the struggling student after using fast forward. Fast forward created literal changes in the brain by recording new network of skills and neural pathways or superhighways. After just eight weeks of use, weaker readers develop the brain activity patterns that resemble those of strong readers. As brain patterns change and are strengthened, learning becomes easier. Researchers have determined there are four cognitive skills that are foundational to all learning. They are memory, attention, processing, and sequencing. These are the skills that help you learn and remember more of your schoolwork. These are also the skills that help you to become a better reader. Fast Forward has been used by over 3 million students in over 50 countries around the world. Many journals and magazines have written about Fast Forward and how it makes a difference for all types of learners. This is not like anything you've ever done before. How does Fast Forward make these changes occur? It's about practice. Just like anyone good at a sport or a musical instrument has to spend a lot of time practicing, fast forward exercises help you practice skills important for learning and for reading. Practice is what builds those super highways in the brain. Fast forward is known for these three things. It's fast, effective, and enduring. Students often make up to one or two years improvement in their reading and also do better in the classroom after using one or more fast forward products. The changes last and carry over to other parts of your life. Remember, practice makes permanent. You need to be on time, start your work promptly, be respectful of your neighbor, wear your headphones properly, ask for help, and look at your percent complete score. Besides being here and getting your work done, the most important thing is making sure you improve your percent complete score each day. The more questions you can answer correctly without missing one, the faster you will complete the exercises and the more your brain will grow. Remember, more is better as long as they're all correct answers. There are so many benefits to working hard and completing this program. This is all about building an even better you. Here's how we'll get started. We'll go through some demos so you can understand what each exercise is about. After that, you'll have an assessment called Reading Progress Indicator that comes up first. 
Just focus and do your best to answer those questions. Then, as you begin, remember to keep working, even if it seems repetitive and boring. It's the practice that changes the brain. So here's our goal, to make school easier and grades better. The way to do that is to jump in, do your best, and let Fast Forward do their thing and get it done. Join the team, work hard, and be successful. You've got this.